Now let us understand the concept of Bastion Server. On AWS, people might hear about this quite frequently. It is also called as uh, Gateway Node or Client Node also. The concept of Bastion Server is on AWS, uh, we might provision many servers for an enterprise and uh, we might deploy many applications on that and the support team and uh, uh, other uh, uh, operations stakeholders might want to make sure uh, they connect uh, to, the, uh, to these servers and uh, fix the issues in regular manner. Well, if we open up uh, the access, for example, in this case, uh, I, I have defined a inbound rule for this uh, demo instance where anyone can connect to this from anywhere using SSH. As long as you have a, a private key um, with the corresponding public key on the server. And if I open this port number, so you can connect to this instance without any issue. If there are 100 servers and if we open up all the 100 servers like this, there can be security issues. People might hack and uh, do damage. So one way to fix this issue is just to give access to certain servers. And from there, we might be able to access the others. So all those servers which will be client facing or uh, uh, operations stakeholder facing is termed as bastion server. Only on those servers we will be opening up SSH uh, to certain IP address ranges and uh, others we will completely hide within the network and if someone have to connect to the rest of the servers first they have to hop onto the bastion server and from there they will be able to connect to other servers. So that's the concept of Bastion Server, to give controlled access through a server to the remaining server. Um, and uh, the server which is configured as, uh, 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 as the uh, client-facing server is called as Bastion Server. So if I have 10 servers, probably one will be Bastion Server. And if I have to connect to the other 9 servers, first I have to hop on to this Bastion Server and from there, I'll be able to connect. That is concept of Bastion Server. We will see that in action as and when it is required. But at this time, it is very important to understand the concept of Bastion Server. Um, uh, whatever uh, technology you want to deploy in future uh, on AWS, you will definitely hear this term called as uh, Bastion Server. I just want to give you a brief overview about it.